Um, show up. Guess what? What? I got a fever. Got and a fever. the only thing that can cure it is more cowbell. After a series of staggering defeats, the Blue Oyster Cult reassembled the recording studio for a session with fame producer Bruce Dickinson. And luckily for us, the cameras were rolling. Alright fellas, I think we're ready to lay down this first track. By the way, the name's Bruce. Yes, THE Bruce Dickinson. And I gotta tell you guys, we got what appears to be a dynamite sound. Coming from you, Bruce? That means a lot. I can't believe that Bruce Dickinson digs our sound. Easy, guys. I put my pants on just like the rest of you. Except, once my pants are on, I make gold records. <laughs> 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 All right. Don't fear the reaper. Take one. Roll it. All right. One, two, three, four. Are you sure that was sounding okay? Alright, I'll be honest with you. It, it sounded great, but I could have used just a little more cowbell. <laughs> Let's take it again and, Keith, yeah. really explore the studio space this time. You got it, right? I mean, really explore the studio space. Roll it! Alright, one, two, three, four! It's just that I find Gene's cowbell playing distracting. If I'm the only one, I'll shut up. You know, I can pull it back a little if you'd like. No, no, not too much. Trust me, we're gonna want this cowbell on a track. Let's take it again. You know what, let's, let's just do the thing. All right. One, two, three, four. Roll it! Alright, 
One, two, three. 